The advertisement block can be used to display advertisement on a website either by uploading an ad image or by entering the ad code. Site owners can promote any specific offers or sales or display Google Ads via this widget. In this video, I will show you how to add advertisement in Sidebar step by step. Please note that you will need to install and activate the Rishi Companion plugin in order to use the advertisement block. From your WordPress admin dashboard, go to Appearance and click on Widgets. Inside the sidebar drop-down option, click on the Add Block icon. Now, search for Rishi Advertisement. Simply type in Advertisement inside the search field. And here is the Rishi Advertisement block. You have to click on it, which will add the block on your sidebar. You can further configure it via the provided block settings on the right hand side. First, you can enter the title for the block added here. So instead of the default advertisement title, you can add in the title of your choice from here. Next, you can choose to display advertisement by entering the ad code or by uploading an ad image. If you select ad code, you will get the option to enter the ad code inside the ad code field. Please note that this option will only be displayed when you select the option to display the ad code from under display advertisement from option. Instead, if you choose to upload an image, you can upload an ad image from here. Please note that this option will only be displayed when you select Upload Image option from under Display Advertisement. For this video tutorial, I will upload an image. So click on Upload Image. Select the image of your choice, then click on Select. Inside the Feature link box, you have to add the URL to where you want your ad image to be linked. For now, I have added the link to our site. Then you can allow your visitors to open the link that you have added here in the new tab by enabling the open in new tab option. Then you can enable the no follow option to add the no follow attribute to the featured link. Then with the attribute sponsored option, you can add sponsored attribute to the featured link by enabling the toggle. After you are done, click on Update. Now let's go to our site. This is the block page where the sidebar is added. Now let's give our block page a refresh. And here is the advertisement block that we added on our sidebar. If you have any questions or confusions, Please do let me know in the comment section below or you can directly reach out to our support team. I have added the link to creating support ticket in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in our next video.